Yo, I ain't here for the money, I ain't here for the fame. Though it might be nice to own a jet plane, I'ma do it all for you. Come along and see us. Yo, what is going on, my pickled potatoes? It is, um, what's my name? It's a legacy boat. That wasn't even a joke. That I just forgot my name. So I'll be showing you guys how to make a custom texture pack idea made by one of my friend's little brothers because that's that's how you make videos nowadays. Um, so you're gonna need two things that you have to download. One of them is just a texture pack. And uh, both of these do not cause viruses. Trust me, a lot of people download both of these. So one of them is a texture pack, which is this one. It's um, it's What's just the default low fire pack. Um, yeah, there's a lot of people that download this one. So, yep. Yeah, um, I'll put the links in the description for downloads, or I'll put downloads in the description for both of these. The second thing you'll need, which is the most important, is Paint.net. Um, I'll put that in the description. I forget like what the uh. URL is this is am I hot or not? I don't know why, but like I, I never mind, never mind. We're gonna get on with the video. So let's actually just download this real quick. Um, hold on, let me see. Okay, yeah, I'll see you guys once we download. I do one point eight, so I'll download one point eight. I already have one of these, but I'm just gonna show you guys. So I'm gonna download it again. And just delete it later, because nobody loves it when it's just for a video. I mean, actually, they do. I mean, who knows? This could turn into a masterpiece. I'm not sure. So, yeah, I'll see you guys when this downloads. Okay, we downloaded our Swagical Texture Pack. It's just um the default texture pack with low fire, so there's really nothing to it. Um, I haven't tried making all my folders and, like, making straight off the bat my own texture pack. Like, just putting a new folder and everything. I don't know... If, if you guys want to do that and don't want to download this texture pack, I guess it's fine, but this just pretty much does all the work for you. So, now, um, just leave it to, in your desktop, I guess. Um, go to paint.net. Okay, so paint.net open layer properties. I have no clue what that is. That never shows up. So now you just open your texture pack, assets, Minecraft, um, whichever... Shaders, no. It's in textures, isn't it? Yeah. Textures, and then whichever texture you want to change, I'm going to change a sword. Items, so swords are in items. Let's change the diamond sword because everybody loves it. Um, oh yeah, if this happens, okay, it's it's really simple. You just you just drag it to the desktop. It copies to the desktop. Um, it won't delete it from here, so you just do that. Then you drag it in. There, you can do that. You can't drag it in straight from that file, I guess. There we go. You're going to have to zoom in too. So, zoom in like this, um, and then, okay, let's see, what do we want to change with this one, um, let's just make it like a green diamond, green, yeah, green is my favorite color, greenish silverish, we'll make a gre green silver, like, high resolution gradient, I get, well, I don't know if it's, I don't know how to make it more high resolution, yeah, I do, go to layer, wait, you know what? I'm not going to confuse you. I'm just going to make it green and gray uh, gradient. Okay? So this is pretty much teaching you how to gradient too. Um, so primary... So basically, let's... Uh, if you want to gradient this, you just got to click magic wand. Click that. And if you want to add more to the gradient, you, you hold down control and then you click there. So let's, let's gradient all of this. Why the fudge cake's not... Um, this is all we're gonna gradient, and then I'm just gonna show you in game that it sh that it showed up. So you go to your primary, whichever primary color you want, and then secondary. Oh shoot. Um, and secondary, whichever color you want. I'm gonna make it lighter. And then with those two colors, it gradients. It gradients from green to gray. So let's do this from this angle. So you just hold down your mouse button. See, it's just gradienting, you know. So let's put it like. It's, this is not a very nice sword, I know, but, like, I just want to show you guys how to make a custom texture pack. Uh, shoot, I did not mean to do that. Back. There we go. And then you click the wand, click off, and then you... Yeah, this is going to be our sword. It's wonderful. Look at it. It's, it's just it's just beautiful, okay? So, we're going to uh, save as. 
Let's save it to desktop, diamondsword.png, save. This one already exists, that was the one that we dragged in from before to when we started. So, boom, and then look look at that, diamondsword.png, I don't, yeah, my photos are messed up, I don't know. But you guys can see it, right? No, you probably can't, but I'll zoom in with Sony Vegas if I'm good enough at editing. Um, so then, what you do is go back to your texture pack file folder thing, um, and you just simply drag it straight in, click copy and replace, and there you go. Now, let's head in game no cuts and i'll show you that it actually works um okay see look i'm not using hacks some people keep on hacking me i guess it's fine but uh yeah i'm not i'm not using hacks um trust me i'm the best block pixelated block player ever so we're going to go here oh yeah i forgot one thing shoot my livers um you actually need to, I mean, you, this could work this way too, it's more easy this way. So you click Options, Resource Pack, Open Resource Pack Folder. You open that up. I have a decent amount of them. I've seen some people have like 20,000 resource packs in their um, folder. Okay, this is going to be called, we have to change the name, I already have one of those. So rename, change it to, uh, just, let's just call it, what? orange let's call it orange um because why not oranges are tasty okay orange look at that look oh my gosh orange shows up even though it has a green diamond sword don't ask okay just answer don't ask just answer okay um that's my map by the way everyone should download it's not even in my description it's like nowhere to be found i'm sorry but see look everything is default you know boom Look at that! We have our own sword. Look, oh, it's so majestic. It's so beautiful. And uh, yeah, that's how you make custom textures. Do this, do this with any custom textures you want. This sword actually looks really cool. I don't know. This actually looks pretty nice. I might. I thought it was ugly at first, but it actually. I don't know. I like it. I think it's just because it's a change. But yeah. Oh my gosh. There's Hero Brian. Um. See you guys later